What's up kids? Sean Tubbs here. Today we are checking out an overdrive pedal by J Rocket Audio Designs and it's called the HRM. Now what does the HRM stand for? Hot rubber monkey. This overdrive pedal is based on a D style circuit. Do the math. Dumble style circuit. Um, and it really sounds great, but the HRM is based on a modification that uh, Dumble would do to amps and also even the overdrive special called the HRM circuit. And it just sounds killer. So the controls are as follows on this pedal. You have a level control, which is your overall output of, of the pedal. You have a gain control, um, obviously controls the gain, but it's a very uh, broad sweep of gain. And we'll get into that in the demo. Uh, you have a treble control controls the treble. And then the most important control on this pedal is the uh, the fat control because that's what's really dialing in and out that HRM style uh, circuit. And it really works great. All four of these controls are very interactive with each other, especially as you are, are rolling the uh, fat control up and down as well as the gain. And we'll definitely get into that uh, in the demo, but this is a really great sounding pedal. Um, the feel of it is is spongy, but at the same time, it's, it's really quick. Um, so yeah, I'm very impressed with this pedal. So without further ado, let's check out the J Rocket Audio Designs HRM. Hot rubber monkey. <laughs> well, let's make some noise. I'm gonna use my Sir Classic Strat style guitar and I'm going to use my uh, my Sir Bella amp uh, for all the tones. Now I'm going to keep the amp pretty clean. I want to make this pedal do all the work. So here's the guitar just into the amp. So that's on the back humbucker of the guitar. There's neck position. It's not breaking up at all. We're going to make the pedal do the work. Here's the HRM. Now this tone to me is, is a very, what I would consider like a core tone. It would be my crunch tone. We're not boosting a bunch above unity gain right now. Let's check the gain range. I'm going to turn the gain almost off. So really nice usable gain range. It feels really good. This pedal has a really nice kind of spongy, but still fairly fast uh, feel to it. Now, when I dimed the gain like that, the only thing I noticed I had to do is was roll the fat off just a little bit, just to get some of the lows out of it. But that just sounds killer. So that's the gain range. Let's check out the treb real quick. I'm just gonna roll it off. I'm gonna turn my guitar back on. It's gonna get really bright. That's pretty toothy, but it does come into play and you're gonna find, or I have found with this pedal, that I tend to chase the, the fat control with the treble as I turn it up. Now we're gonna look at the fat control. The way it works is, is it's really, that's what's part of the whole HRM circuit that's adding uh, the kind of mids and, and kind of martial thing. As you roll that up, it's gonna add that bark, but it also adds some low end, but we have to keep in mind that it is boosting the overall level of the pedal. So uh, the volume of the pedal is gonna have to probably come down a little bit as we roll this up, especially as we start rolling gain. And then we might have to chase it a little bit with the, uh, 
with the treb control. So uh, I'll just start where it's at. <laughs> Now that's a lot fatter. I'm gonna roll some treble into it. Now I'm noticing we're a little bit more above unity gain than I'd like to be. Now I'll keep rolling the fat control up. We'll add treble. control all the way up it gets a little extreme but that's a you know such a great sounding circuit it just feels great like huge solo tones but I could still you know back off and use my fingers and play like chord voicings and it was still really clear <laughs> That's a rock and roll machine. It's a really good sounding pedal. So that is the Rocket Pedals uh, HRM or uh, Hot Rubber Monkey. If you've got any questions, obviously go to the website and check things out. But as always, I really appreciate you guys tuning in and we will see you next time.